I let, I basically let go of a balloon that had helium inside it, and guess what? Mm. I used binoculars. Hey everyone, we are making my paleo strawberry shortcake and I'm about to make some dry ingredients. Let me show you what we've got. Two cups of fine ground almond meal, two tablespoons coconut flour, one teaspoon baking powder. You can make your own homemade baking powder that's grain free. I have that on the blog. Half a teaspoon um, Redmond Real Salt and a quarter teaspoon of pure stevia extract. Whisk that up like so. I'm gonna get all the plumps out, make sure it's nicely nice and even. And then you're going to make a well in the middle for the wet ingredients. So the wet ingredients, you're gonna do three large eggs at room temperature is best or they can be cool just not like super cold from the fridge when you're baking and half a cup of oil i use avocado i use olive oil you can also use avocado oil then you're gonna whisk the eggs and oil together in the what middle there Hold on back. and adding the air into the eggs um will then create lift and you get that fluff in your shortbread biscuits okay and then now we're gonna incorporate, use a spatula to fold all that together. So when you fold in the ingredients, you know, it's very much literal. Fold, fold, fold it in until you get a dough. And the, the dough will be like this. And this will be it's nice and firm enough so you can shape your biscuits by hand. And these are still cooking down. You're gonna keep cooking these until they're really thick. So when you go like this, you should be able to get, you see that streak, it'll stay there longer. Um, the natural sugars and the berries and all that is thickens this up quite nicely. So, you know, it's just about patience and keep simmering and keep stirring and you can, until you get that thick stickiness. Keep stirring, baby. I got my little sous chef here on berry duty and I'm gonna make the biscuits now. So, so you'll shape the biscuits like so. <clears throat> Excuse me. I ended up doing them mini. The original recipe makes five large biscuits and two, four, six, eight. I made nine makes this ice cream scoop. And this works out because um, for the kids having little mini servings is best. This jelly is good. Mm -hmm. So since these are mini, I only bake them for half the time. And now they're ready to go. You know they're cooked. They're ready when they're they're fluffy, they're nice and risen, and they've got some lightly golden parts. And we've got our strawberry jam. And then we've got our cream. I have coconut cream here for my dairy-free folks and some triple cream um, Siggy's yogurt for Jack. And we're gonna assemble. Carol's gonna fall. Eat it. Look at mm. it. That's good.